Gracias, colega. Tiene un minuto el señor Martin Callanan. Thank you, Mr. President. The public, the hard-working taxpayers across Europe who actually earn the money that so many in this place are so keen to spend, want Europe to do less and they want Europe to do it better. They want a lean European budget which takes into account that whether we like it or not, we are living in an age of austerity. They want Europe to focus on the very limited number of areas where Europe can actually add value to the rest and leave the rest of those activities to our member states. Unfortunately, this report proposes none of those things. So let us be clear. The suggestion of a 5% increase is completely unacceptable. The idea of so-called unresource own resources is equally unacceptable. It's just another power grab by the EU. The budget should be modernised. Funds should be reallocated to programmes that actually deliver future benefits and not cover up past failures. <coughs> Financing of Euro bailouts should be left to those countries that actually wanted to join the Euro in the first place. Um, those of us who warned that it was a mistake should not be forced to contribute towards it. The committee had a chance to pursue many of these constructive and uh, future-proof suggestions. They've rejected it. They've done none of those things and it should be rejected by this House. Thank you. Gracias. Señor Callanan, tiene dos minutos ahora para su intervención el señor Laszlo Surian. Köszönöm a szót, elnök úr. Ennek a ciklusnak talán a legfontosabb jelentése van a kezünkben. Az Európai Parlament az intézmények közül elsőként fogalmazza meg gondolatot.